Hey, it's Colin, and I'm back with another Let's Try. Today I've got the uh, Twix Cookies and Cream and Twix Salted Caramel. So let me go ahead and get the squid on. I uh, got something new for the background here. It's got my, uh, my, my temporal excursion gear hanging up back there, and I got me and Takare's face plates sitting up on top. I don't know if you can see that up there. Excuse me a moment. So here we have Twix cookies and cream share size. <coughs> 100 calories per serving. Four bars per package. You got really nice looking picture of it up here on the front. On the back, <coughs> we got the ingredients up there, <coughs> and we got the nutrition facts and the barcode down there. Nutrition facts: first servings per container. So <coughs> each of these is gonna oh, so it's 100 calories per serving, 400 calories per pack. <coughs> Serving size one cookie, 20 grams. Servings per calorie, 100. Oh, real quick, it says. Down here on the bottom edge here, cream with cookie bits, chocolate cookie bars, and milk chocolate, period. <clears throat> uh, where were we? Mount per serving daily value. Total fat, 6 grams, 8%. Saturated fat, 3.5 grams, 18%. Trans fat, 0 grams. Cholesterol, 0 grams, 0 milligrams. Sodium, 35 milligrams, 2%. Uh... Total carbs, 13 grams, 5%. Total dietary fiber, 0 grams, 0%. 0 total sugars, 9 grams. And 8 grams added sugars, 1 gram protein. 0 vitamin D, 0 calcium, 2 iron, and 0 potassium. This is the uh, salted caramel one. <coughs> Share size. We got a nice picture of the uh, candy bar <coughs> on the side here. <coughs> this one's got a vanilla cookie. That one's got a, a dark chocolate cookie. <coughs> and here on the bottom, it's a crunchy cookie sea salt caramel creamy chocolate. <coughs> And just so that I can do this easier. <coughs> okay, there are a bunch of differences in the uh, nutrition facts. The uh, <coughs> Somehow, the cookie size is 21 grams on the caramel. Oh, wow. The caramel actually weighs more. The uh, cookies and cream is 2.72 ounces or 77.1 gram. And the caramel is 2.82 ounce or 79.9 grams. So this is technically probably your better value. But if you don't like caramel for, you know. Where was I? Oh, yeah, the caramel nutrition facts. 6% um, total saturated fat. 15%. No. 4.5 gram total fat. 3 gram saturated fat. Zero cholesterol. Hi, Mr. Train. Uh, 95 milligrams sodium, 14 carb, 14 grams of, of carbs, zero dietary fiber, 10 grams sugar, one protein, and zeros across the bar for for added uh, whatevers. <clears throat> now I'm thinking the ingredients should be fairly similar. So, uh, chocolate, cocoa butter, skim milk, lactose, milk, fat, leptin, and artificial flavor, palm oil, enriched wheat flour, reduced iron, thiamine, monocitrate, riboflavin, sugar, corn syrup, less than 2% cocoa powder processed with alkali, skim milk, modified cornstarch, salt, cocoa powder, 
soy lecithin whey protein allergy information. Contains bioengineered food ingredients. We got Dr. Insano working up on this shit. Okay, so, um, this one says this cookies and cream is mostly all chocolates. And really, the only difference is, is less chocolate. Yeah, so it's, uh, on, on, on this one, it's, it's milk chocolate. Oh. Is it a different chocolate? It is a different kind of chocolate. Okay. Bitchin. No, it's both milk chocolate. Never mind. Milk chocolate, sugar, cocoa butter, chocolate skim milk, blah, 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 blah. In wheat, wheat flour. Because these are wheat cookies instead of chocolate cookies. Uh, niacin, reduced iron. Reduced. Uh, what the fuck is reduced iron? Is, is that Iron Man on, on low battery? Thiamine, monotrate, bribal, flavin, folic acid, sugar, palm oil. Corn syrup, skim milk, dextrose, less than 2% sea salt, salt, coca, allergen powder, soy lecithin, modified cornstarch, baking soda. Allergen information contains milk, soy, and wheat to may contain peanuts. What's interesting is um, there's less ingredients in the caramel than there is in the cookie and cream. It is interesting. Which one do you want to eat first? You want the caramel one? Alright, we'll eat the caramel one. Alright, okay, okay. Here we go with the caramel one. Oh, that. There we go. Alright, it's a little a little squished and it's a little little warm, so I'm getting my fingerprints on it, but let's go ahead. Oh. That caramel. Getting the right amount of pull with caramel can be really tricky sometimes. That cookie crushes up really nicely. It blends really nicely. This taste... Doesn't Twix normally have caramel in it? But it is... The, the, you can taste the salt. <clears throat> it is a stronger, saltier caramel. It's good. It reminds me of sea salt. Like those, those um, sea salt can't cut chocolate bars you get. Mmm. Nah, I have to... The caramel, like, wraps around everything as you chew it. And the cookies get mixed up inside the caramel. And the chocolate blends all around. Mmm. Just... Oh, Ed. There's a solid chunk of salt in there. Yeah. I think it reminds me of sea salt. It actually says on the back, sea salt's one of the ingredients. Let's go ahead and now. Mmm. That is definitely good shit. This one's starting to melt a little bit more than the other one. <coughs> so I don't want to <coughs> squish it as I open it. <coughs> oh, yeah, it's getting kind of <coughs> ugly. <coughs> Neither one of these are good for if you got if you got gluten allergies, stay away from these. Right, so <coughs> you got a little bit of frosting up here on the top. Oh, hey, look at that. It's peeling away just like an Oreo. Look at that. That looks good. Tastes nothing like Oreo frosting. No. It's its own thing. 
um, a little bit of cookies in there. I really do want to say it reminds me of the Hershey's cookies and cream candy bar, but like if they made it into a paste instead of a solid chocolate. They uh, they wrapped the cookie in chocolate and then just layered the uh, cream on top. The cookie is still good. It's better with the, uh, oh, wow. These things are filling. I've only had, like, what, what two and a half? Oh. <clears throat> they hit your stomach really hard, dude. I'm going to stop. Because I got proper, proper dinner cooking for me. Do you, uh, want to see the inside of that? Let's see if I can, uh... Oh, yeah, look at that caramel pole. That was really freaking nice right there. That's good. Put you guys over there for later. Um, this has been Colwyn with a let's try of the uh, Twix cookies and cream and the uh, salted caramel. They're both really good. If 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 you prefer caramel over cookies and cream, you got your options. All right, buy some, try them both. Yeah, thanks for watching.